Before this video starts, boys, if you guys are interested in cheap Pet Simulator X huges and gems, you can find this Discord server in the second link of the description. It has over 100 vouchers and it's very reputable. Very cheap prices. Now onto the video. Yo, what's up, boys? Today I'm going to show you how to bypass the update required with the new Roblox um, update they pushed. So to continue exploiting, you'll need to do this. So I'll have every step that I do in the link of the description um, in order. So first, if you haven't downgraded yet, if you already, if you see this screen, you don't need to do the first step, you can go on to the second step. But if you don't have this, if you're on the newest version, basically what you need to do is in the first link in the description, I'll have this download. So you'll just, uh, when you download it, you're gonna run it and I'll show you what it looks like when you run it. All right, so when you open the file, this is what it's gonna look like. If you don't have Roblox installed, it'll just say install. Or if you need to downgrade, you'll just click reinstall. So you'll click reinstall and then you'll have this closed. So we'll just close that. Now right here. Now it'll say update required to open and say this. So basically we're gonna close this. Now for the second step, you're gonna need HTTP debugger, which is gonna be the second step. It's gonna be the second link of the description. So basically I'll open that. So once you download it, you'll have this setup here. You'll just click next, accept, install, my screen's going to go black. It's an administrator thing. You'll just click yes. Now right here, this is what you're going to see. Now when you first open it, it might have some pop-ups. You'll just click yes or start or whatever it says. But basically when you have this open, you're going to want to click www. And then you want to reopen Roblox. If you have Roblox already open, close it, reopen it. So you're going to open it. And then right here, it's going to say this right here. You're going to right click it. You're going to copy and you're going to go URL. Now the second step or the third step you're going to need to do, you're going to make it a text document. I already have a text document made, but basically I'll show you what you need to put in it. It's going to be the third thing. So you're going to make a new text document and let me find it. Here we go. Right here, you're going to put this in a text document. You can put it wherever. Just make sure you know where to find it. You're going to put this in. This is going to be in the description. Uh, you'll save it and once you saved it, you'll close it. And then right here is you're going to click auto reply, add rule with file. And then with the file, you'll go over to whatever you did, open. And then right here, this is going to be blank. But what you're going to want to put is that Roblox thing. So what you copied here, make sure you did URL. You're going to paste it in here and then you're going to click save. And now we have that. You'll minimize this. You don't close this. If you close it, you'll still have the update required. So we're going to close it. We're going to reopen it. And then basically, you'll see that will load in. So there we go, we load in. And now, as long as you have this open, you won't have the update required. So you'll need to have that. And then now, I'll show you, um, the last link, I guess, will be um, an executor. I use Fluxus. So to download Fluxus, I'll have the link also in there. All right, and then when you have your Fluxus, you'll just click Inject. And we'll wait a second. And then once, uh, we waited a second after clicking inject. We will just load into a game and you'll know you're injected when it says Fluxus UWP has injected. There we go. So that's when you know it's injected. And then you'll just run whatever script you have. This is just an admin command script. So as you can see, now we have admin commands. So that's how you exploit now with the update required. That's how you bypass the update required. And yeah, if you have any questions, uh, leave them in the comments. Every step will be in the description. Make sure you follow it step by step don't skip any step and make sure if you have problems you watch carefully but yeah any questions leave in the comments and yeah thank you guys for watching peace